Hi Bestie! So I want to do a little like get to know me educational video I guess. I'm still trying to figure out what I would call this. But anyway, I just want to talk about me and someone very important to me. So as some of you may know, I am an education major. Special education to be exact. So the story behind why I decided to do special education, because for the longest time, I wanted to do education. But a few years after my sister was born, we found out she has autism. And it was a big shock because me as a kid, I'm like, huh? I'm not gonna lie, my first thought was like, Austin? What? Like, what's Austin? Like, when I was a kid, I did not know what that meant. But like, going through like the research and like finding all the like help she needs, I was very interested in like what they do with special needs kids, like how they help them. Then after like seeing that, like when she was in preschool, then going to kindergarten, first grade, going up, I was like, okay. I like that, I love that they take the time to like, not only like just the educator, but like actually like take care of her. Like they helped a lot with her growing up. So I'm like, I want to do that for someone else too. I want to be there to help a student with special needs. Cause like, a teacher is also a role model and you're supposed to help mold the child as well. So seeing how they mold my younger sister, I was like, wow, I I love it. And though I'm like looking from the outside, I love it. I love how they take the time to care about her. Even now, like, our relationship with our teachers are like this. Like, they text my mom about anything. Like, they are so loving and welcome to us. Not because, oh, we're such and such a family. No, they actually like care. And like, I wanted to do that and I love like doing, I've been in special ed for like a couple years now. Yeah, mm -hmm. undergrad and grad doing special ed. And like, I still want to do it. I'm still like doing it. I know it could be a little hard, especially like writing all IEP, all these reports, but at the end of the day, it's worth it. It's a lot of work. Mm -hmm. But you feel rewarded mm -hmm. knowing that you're helping a child in need. Because kids, all kids should be loved and helped equally. That's my motto. Doesn't matter if you have a disability or not. You should have the opportunity to learn, especially on your own page as well. Because we all, some kids may not understand the right way as others. So it's our turn, like our t job to make sure everyone gets it, even if that requires us to change it up a little bit. Okay, but anyway, anyway. This is gonna be a short video, so don't worry. I want you to meet the person who inspired me to do special ed. Don't ignore the fact that she's wearing her Eagle onesie. She had it for like almost five years now. She's not giving it up. So I want you to meet her. Come here. Come here. Uh, you might have to say, I only got one chair, so you might, we got <laughs> So, this, she's sweaty because she's hot, and she refused to take off the outfit. So, this is her. Look at the camera. Do you wave or say hi? Mm -hmm. See, I think she's camera shy. Or, she's too focused on her game. But, this is my inspiration. Yeah. Uh, Ma'am. Right. Not her giving me attitude on camera. Okay, you can go back to making your game. <laughs> that, she said she became a teenager. I play it. Tell me you did not break it. Anyway, that is my other half. And I think it's a great idea to introduce you guys to her because our birthdays are next month and I'm gonna do a birthday vlog like the first part would be about her because her birthday is before mine and the other half it could be for me so I figured it makes sense to introduce you guys to her first before those videos come down 
All right, that's it for today's video. I hope you guys have a great day. Mm -hmm. Stay cool. Bye bye. Mm -hmm. And drink plenty of water. Mm -hmm. Bye. I'll see you in the next one. Georgia for the man.